Hey guys, it is Jen with Mother Time. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I am so happy you are here. Today I have another fun and easy craft. I'm gonna be sharing how I made this darling flag. Look how cute it is, you guys. And yes, it coordinates with the Uncle Sam door hanger as well as the firecrackers I've also shared. I love having everything coordinate together and be part of a collection. So this is a great addition to that. You can either hang this somewhere on a wall or a door or lean this against something too. This is so fun and easy to make. I cannot wait to show you how I made this. So let's get started. To begin, I am using one of these 23 and a half inch long signs from Dollar Tree. Every time I see these signs at Dollar Tree, I always pick up several, so I have them on hand for crafts like this. I've removed the hanger from the back, but if you plan on hanging this, don't remove that. Next, I'm going to cut out my scrapbook paper using a rotary cutter, and this scrapbook paper is from Hobby Lobby. I cut the star scrapbook paper to fit the sign, and then I trimmed it so it was seven and a half inches long. only needed one sheet of the striped scrapbook paper for this project. I first cut it down to fit the sign and then use the remaining half and trim that down to fit the sign as well. Next, I'm going to line up my scrapbook paper before I Mod Podge it onto the sign. I'm going to apply a coat of Mod Podge to the sign and then attach my scrapbook paper. I'm starting at the bottom and working my way up and doing the stars last. I also trimmed my striped scrapbook paper a little bit more. Now I'm going to set this aside to dry and start working on my star. I found these stars at Dollar Tree and I'm going to use one to attach to the sign. I am painting the back of the star with folk art chalk paint that I get at Hobby Lobby in the color white and Adirondack. I did apply a few coats. I'm going to hot glue the star to the top of the sign. I'm going to make myself a tag. You could buy pre-made tags as well, and I'm going to write USA on it. I'm going to distress my tag with folk art wax in the color antique wax. Next, I unraveled a little piece of nautical rope from Dollar Tree and I'm going to hot glue that to the sign. I'm going to take a little piece of twine and attach that to the tag and then attach the tag to the sign with some hot glue.
making a little raffia bow and I'm going to attach that to the sign with some hot glue. Couldn't resist adding a little rusty star as well. Now for my favorite part, distressing the sign. I am using folk art wax in the color antique wax and brushing it all over the sign and rubbing it off with a paper towel to give it a distressed look. And that's it you guys, this sign turned out so cute. I absolutely love it. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Thank you so much for spending some time crafting with me today and I will see you guys in the next video.